in the 80s, there was one way to be cool, to wear a jacket, but to wear this jacket, you had to be a member of the club because it was a members only jacket. Guys, 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 or girls, ladies, if you will, or whatever you identify as. I'm not here to judge anyone. Uh, I was on my Facebook, Jumpman Group, link's in the description, uh, and I saw this come up. Hey, Jumpman, what's with this members-only bull crap? And at first, I thought, maybe he's talking about how I'm posting more members-only videos, clips, and outtakes, and commentary, and a lot of fun reactions and stuff. Uh, but then it hit me, maybe he's talking about those member-only jackets. Maybe he thinks I'm a members only. Who knows? So then I thought, man, I've talked about a lot of stuff from the 80s. Especially iconic 80s stuff. I mean, I've done a whole video on MC Hammer. Oh, well, that was the 90s. <laughs> it don't matter. I didn't really do a video on that yet anyway. But I did like the Rubik's Cube. I don't know people clicked on that one. But I haven't ever really talked in depth about members only, the jacket. And I'm not going to talk about it in depth today. We're just going to look at some ads and reminisce. Because if you grew up in the 80s, you had a members only jacket. Don't lie. Don't perpetrate like you didn't. Because I know you did. I know you did. I mean, they were they were kind of like a trash bag material, it seemed like. And I didn't know till the day they still they got a members only website. They still sell members only stuff. I can't remember the last time I saw any. They look different now, but it was kind of it was like a windbreaker maybe. Had a little thing on right here that said members only, but it had a button up here. It had had like things on the shoulder, like sh not shoulder pads, like a little stripe with a button on it and everything. Oh, come on, it Doc man. Who doesn't like buttons on their shoulders? It's a good place to hang your keys. I don't understand. You always wear stupid looking t-shirts anyway. I got right. class. You are right. I <sighs> hope that never I hope that character never returns. <sighs> so freaky I can't even talk. But what's new? I can't talk anyway. Let's look at some of these ads right here. Here's a bunch of kids. Look at that kid in the middle. Oh, this is the kind of kid I would have saw on the school bus and wanted to slap the shit out of and knock that hat out the window. But I wouldn't do it because he would have kicked my ass. Uh, but look at all these with their... Now, these are a little different style members only. Not the classic members only we always know. What's it say? The brand that's changing the way Americans look. Now, that they did. When these jackets became popular, I don't know what happened in, co in pop culture to make them popular. But I tell you, man, these everybody had a members-only jacket. Let's look at another one. Oh, here's Corey Feldman from Stand By Me. This is what made the jacket popular. If you ask me, this comes from Goonies. Goonies right here. This is when everybody wanted a members-only jacket. They saw Goonies and said, hey. And then it became a huge fad. He does have a purple rain shirt yeah i won't hold it against it. i won't hold him against it but he did i know jump over on purple rain just not my dig just not my dig sauce okay nothing against it but anyway there he is where's see on the shoulders up there i don't understand that but there's a memories only jacket from a cool kid that was cool in the 80s and now he's even a cooler adult how about this ad I never even knew Leaf Garrett had a members only jacket. He's got a right white one. And we ain't got no undershirt under or nothing. And he's got it zipped over his big old belly. It was the 80s. You could have a big old belly. I don't know about today. I got a big old belly, but hey. Living like it's the 80s. I'm living like it's the 80s. How about this right here? Oh, that kid. Why is the littlest kid in the chair? Stand up. Let's see, we got, uh, that's a guy to play Alfred from the Batman movie. Look at that, we got a little, can you believe it? we got, see who that is? Justine Bateman's brother, Jason Bateman right there. Man, that's an all-star cast photo where members only. Look at that, Jennifer Connelly in a red one. And who's that? Zach Braff. Zach Braff in a blue one. This is getting weird. Man, I don't know who the little kid is. I don't know who the little kid is. Everybody else became famous. She became a loser, maybe. Maybe she was a drug addict. Well, how about this? That's damn right. 
the Gatlin brothers. The Gatlin brothers had members only jackets. You thought they were just for the cool teenagers or hip 20 year olds? Nope. Your dad had a members only jacket because I saw Larry Gatlin wearing one. I know you're saying, what's one's Larry Gatlin? We all know it's the one in the green. We know Larry Gatlin's in the green. The other ones, here's his brothers. No one knows their, nobody knows their names. The Gatlin brothers. The Gatlin brothers. That's all we know. Uh, I don't. If you just want, if you want me to give them a name, I will. Steve and Todd G uh, Gatlin. There you go. Todd and Steve Gatlin. But we all know Larry Gatlin. Larry Gatlin's the main one, right? Uh, check this out. Oh, more famous people. How about that? There's that kid with the silver spoon kid. Ricky Schroeder in a red one. Hey, look at that. Tina Yothers in a blue one. And look in the very back. That's a cool kid. Ralph Macchio. Ralph Macchio back there. And I think that's Judith Light. Not wearing a members only jacket. How can you be in a members only ad without a members only jacket? Doesn't make any sense. Oh, man. The Gatlin brothers are at it again. Larry. And his brother, I don't know their names. Larry, I mean his brothers, uh, Teddy and Dwight Gatlin, I guess. I don't know. There's Larry. Which one's Larry Gatlin? He's in the red. You know that. Uh, they're they're looking cool. They look like some pool hustlers. They play pool on the weekend in their members-only jacket, and then they go rock out a concert. Look at that in their members-only jacket. You can do everything in your members-only jacket. Oh, you see how it's got the Ah, oh, come on, oh, junk man. God, More people would buy a shirt over at junkmanmerch.com if only you have some buttons on your shoulders. Everybody likes buttons on their shoulders. Unless you're not a member of the Members Only Club. That's disturbing. How about this right here? These just kind of look like some really thick Members Only jacket. I don't know about these. And why are they holding hands? Are they lovers? Did he just stick his members only and her members only? Look at this. Man. That's Scarecrow and Mrs. King. Even they are in the ads. That's crazy right there. How about... I looked at that one already. I looked at that one already. Uh, I think we looked at these two wearing something else, but here they are in another members only jacket. Look at that purple one. Look at that purple members only. He got the little. He always had the little collar thing to hung down. Like you're supposed to strap it over here and be all up on your neck and choke it. But nobody did. And you let it hang down. You let it hang down like you were one of the Gatlin brothers. Oh, how about this from the Frames magazine? I guess. Look at that. The black. I had a gray one. I mean, I had a gray one. I, I all admit I had a gray one. There's the red one. Look at that red one from that. Look at. Oh, I think that's Leonard Nimoy back there. And the white one. How about? Oh, another all man. See how many celebrities we got. Leonard Nimoy in the white back there. <laughs> Got the Force Kelly in the black. Kirstie Alley in the red. And who, I, my eyes can't see really good. Who is, oh, Wayne Rogers. Wayne Rogers in the back. I'll talk about an all-star cast photo. How about, man, we looked at that already. And, man, members only. Oh, come Everybody, on, man. Why don't you lay shoulder straps on your shirt? comes in handy when you pass down the bathroom of the Spice Girls concert and your wife's got to drag you back to the car. Members only jacket. I had a gray one. I think I also had a black one. I ain't trying to brag I'm I had two members only jacket. Oh, young man, look at you. Oh, rich kid of the neighborhood. I just remember a gray one and I remember a black one. I think my dad had a black one and I took it later on. I guess he moved on. Probably got a burgundy one or something. I don't know. Maybe he got a red one. Anyway, let me know about the members only jacket you had. Don't act like you didn't have one. Tell me what color you had in the comment section below. And it's members only tonight. Now listen to it. Thank you, sir, for that unsolicited <laughs> testimony.